Hello, everybody. This is Hiki with the La Samba podcast. This is our first one. And today we're going to go back to Brazil in the early 1970s. Brazil had just been world champion with probably the best team of all times, or the most uh, uh, the strongest victory in a World Cup that a country has ever had. Was it Pelé, Jairzinho, Rivelino, Cristão? Like a great, great, great team. Um, the political implications and stuff, but we, we, we won't talk about that today. Anyway, Brazil was living a football FIFA at the time. And in Rio, the biggest team was Flamengo. They were like the, 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 or you loved them or you hated them, but everybody talked about them. And this song is about this team. About Flamengo and one of its players, Fio. Uh, Fio is not a uh, name, right? It's a nickname. Uh, and it's a thread. So his name was Fio Maravilha. It's like the Marvel thread. At, at the time, players didn't uh, uh, use their name. It's not like nowadays, Lionel Messi, Cristiano Ronaldo. He, no, they, they, they all had nicknames like Pelé, Vavá, Garrincha, Zico, who came up a bit later, but they, they, they all played by the nickname. So this guy was called Fio Maravilha. And this song is about a goal that he did in the Maracanã. The Maracanã was also something else. It was like, at the time, the biggest stadium in, in the world, uh, capacity of 160,000 people, and you'd have like uh, 100,000 people, 120,000 people watching a, a game and the atmosphere was crazy with you know, people chanting on one side from one team, another side, another team and when there was a goal everybody went mad and it was like a very, very, very intense atmosphere. This song it narrates uh, uh, this goal that he did as the radio commentators would, would speak and they were also like big 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 um uh, uh, characters in Carioca male life in all classes and um it narrates that I go I'll try to play it here it's a very easy song okay for those who know how to play it's basically uh um see Muito amor, com emoção, com explosão e gol Sacudindo a torcida aos 33 minutos do segundo tempo Depois de fazer uma jogada celestial em gol Fio Maravilha, the player, he, he, like the players in those days, they, they uh, played in, in, in their uh, uh, prime and then they 
went back to the favela or or, or they uh, uh, they they didn't get rich it's not like nowadays they if you play uh, for for five years in football uh, if you, you're you're good you um the rest of your life is guaranteed you make a lot of money but in those days no so this guy he ended up in san francisco if i'm not mistaken as a pizza deliverer guy I, I I have a friend who who was there and he saw few maravilla delivering a pizza to him. Can you imagine, like a big name in Brazilian football? Anyway, he sued he sued Jorge Ben, the guy who wrote the song. Uh, he was Jorge Ben was like a big Flamengo fan, but he sued him and Jorge Ben now he 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 can't use the name Fio Maravilha. He has to use Filho. Maravilha, which is Sun, uh, Marvel Sun. Anyway, uh, we hope you liked this podcast. Hopefully, it's the first of many. And I hope to see you again. Bye.